God come to our aid. O Lord, make haste to help us. Glory be to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Lord Jesus, think on me and purge away my sins. From earthborn passion set me free and make me pure within. Lord Jesus, think on me with care and woe oppressed. Let me thy loving servant be, and taste thy promised rest. Lord Jesus, think on me amid the battle's strife, in all my pain and misery. Be thou my health and life. Lord Jesus, think on me, nor let me go astray through darkness and perplexity. Point thou the heavenly way. You must worship the Lord, your God, and serve him alone. The Lord's revelation to my master, sit at my right. Your foes I will put beneath your feet. The Lord will will from sun, your scepter of power. Rule in the midst of all your foes, a prince from the day of your birth on the holy mountains. From the womb before the dawn I begot you. The Lord is one on earth, he will not change. You are a priest forever, a priest like Melchizedek of old, the master standing at your right hand will shatter kings in the day of his wrath. He shall drink from the stream by the wayside, and therefore he shall lift up his head. Give praise to the Father Almighty, to his Son, Jesus Christ the Lord, to the Spirit who dwells in our hearts, both now and forever. Amen. You must worship the Lord, your God, and serve him alone. Now is the favourable time. This is the day of salvation. When Israel came forth from Egypt, Jacob's sons from an alien people. Judah became the Lord's temple. Israel became his kingdom. The sea fled at the sight. The Jordan turned back on its course. The mountains leapt like rams and the hills like yielding sheep. Why was it see that you fled, that you turned back Jordan on your course? Mountains that you left like rams, hills like yielding sheep. Tremble, O earth, before the Lord, in the presence of the God of Jacob, who turns a rock into a pool, 
and flint into a spring of water. Give praise to the Father Almighty, to His Son, Jesus Christ the Lord, to the Spirit who dwells in our heart, both now and forever. Amen. Now is the favourable time. This is the day of salvation. Now we are going up to Jerusalem, and everything that is written about the Son of Man will come true. Christ suffered for you, leaving you an example that you should follow in his steps. He committed no sin, no guile was found on his lips. When he was reviled, he did not revile in return. When he suffered, he did not threaten, but he trusted to him who judges justly. He himself bore our sins in his body on the tree, that we might die to sin and live to righteousness. By his wounds you have been healed. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, as now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Now we are going up to Jerusalem, and everything that is written about the Son of Man will come true. All the runners at the stadium are trying to win, but only one of them gets the prize. You must run in the same way, meaning to win. All the fighters at the games go into strict training. They do this just to win a wreath that will wither away. But we do it for a wreath that will never wither. Hear us, Lord, and have mercy, for we have sinned against you. Hear us, Lord, and have mercy, for we have sinned against you. Listen, Christ, to the prayers of those who cry to you. Hear us, Lord, and have mercy, for we have sinned against you. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Hear us, Lord, and have mercy, for we have sinned against you. Keep watch over us, eternal Saviour. Do not let the cunning tempter overcome us for you have become our helper at all times. My soul glorifies the Lord, my spirit rejoices in God my Saviour. He looks on his servant in a loneliness, henceforth all ages will call me blessed. The Almighty works marvels for me. Holy is name. His mercy is from age to age. On those who fear him. He puts for his arm in strength. And scatters the proud hearted. He casts the mighty from their thrones and raises the lowly. He fills the starving with good things, sends the rich away empty. He protects Israeli servant, remembering his mercy. The mercy promised to our fathers, to Abraham and his sons forever. Praise the Father, the Son, and Holy Spirit, both now and forever, world without end. Keep watch over us, eternal Saviour. Do not let the cunning tempter overcome us for you have become our helper at all times.
God the Father has chosen for himself a people who are born again, not from any mortal seed, but from his everlasting word. Let us praise his name and turn to him in prayer. Lord, have mercy on your people. Merciful God, hear our prayers for all your people. May they hunger more for your word than for any human food. Lord, have mercy on your people. Teach us to love sincerely the people of our nation and of every race on earth. May we work for their peace and welfare. Lord, have mercy on your people. Strengthen those who will be reborn in baptism. Make them living stones in the temple of your spirit. Lord, have mercy on your people. May the dying go forward in hope to meet Christ their judge. May they see your face and be happy forever. Lord, have mercy on your people. At the Saviour's command, and formed by divine teaching, we dare to say, Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come. Thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Through our annual Lenten observance, Lord, deepen our understanding of the mystery of Christ, and make it a reality in the conduct of our lives. Through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, God, forever and ever. Amen. The Lord bless us and keep us from all evil and bring us to everlasting life.